So people, the news of Shadow Keep being postponed has just broke. Like, wow. How's it going, guys? My name's DPJ, and I'd like to thank you for stopping by and checking out my video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like really helps out. And if you are new around here and enjoy daily Destiny videos, be sure to subscribe. So I follow, obviously, Bungie, Luke Smith, Deej, all of those guys on Twitter. And Luke Smith literally... 15 minutes ago from me making this video, tweeted out uh, a statement stating that Shadowkeep, the next major expansion for Destiny 2, has been postponed with a link to Bungie.net where they state the following. Hey everyone, as we get closer and closer to serving up Shadowkeep and New Light, it has become increasingly clear to us that our releases for this fall would benefit from a bit more time in the oven. Being dependent means the future of Destiny 2 is entirely on our team. It also means that we're agile enough to choose to do what's best for the game and our players, even if it's the hard choice. We wanted to let you, our community, know first that we'll be changing the date for Shadowkeep and New Light from September 17th to October 1st. This fall is the first step on our journey for what our team wants Destiny 2 to become, a place for you and your friends to play anytime, anywhere, owning the action, MMO and RPG elements that we love about the game and crushing barriers to entry for friends. We just need a bit of extra time to take the first step. We didn't make this decision lightly, we know for some of you, us too, Destiny releases are events where you take time off of work or develop a sudden sickness that keeps you from school or work. We get it, a bunch of our team take some time off to go on their own Destiny Jacket quest. We're sorry for screwing up your plans and we wanted to share this information as quickly as we could. Here's some more date house cleaning. The world first for the new raid, Garden of Salvation, will begin on Saturday, October 5th. It's a weekend raid race and contests will be active. We'll extend in moments of triumph through September 17th. You'll have three more weeks to complete this year's challenges and unlock all of the in-game and bungee rewards. We're going to run an additional Iron Banner uh, the week of September 17th as well. That's actually pretty cool to me. People in my house should have another chance of getting the Swarm of the Raven. Trust save will come online later this summer, so you'll have time to sort out your friends list ahead of Shadow Key. More to come next week. Thanks for playing and we'll see you soon, Luke and Mark. So there we have it, people. Shadow Keep has been postponed. Now, the way I feel about this news is, I mean, hey, better them actually sort out the issues they are having than serve us up something that is undercooked. As they say, they need a bit more time in the oven. And the fact they are not tied in with Activision now allows them to actually do this kind of thing. If there's a problem with a game and they don't want to release it early, they can actually take more time and make it perfect, which is what I'm hoping Shadowkeep will be. But yeah, I just wanted to make this quick video for you guys, just uh, announcing this latest news that Shadowkeep will be postponed until October 1st, which to be honest, isn't too much of a gap from September 17th or is it just a few more weeks so it isn't too bad but let me know what you think about this down below within that comment section and on that note we have come to the end guys if you enjoyed the video leave a like really helps out if you're new around here and enjoy daily destiny videos be sure to subscribe and if you never want to miss a video upload you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button but guys thanks as always for stopping by hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully i will see you on that next one